Welcome back to video 2 of the Linux command series. In this video I'm going to go over two commands because uh, one of the commands is short and sweet. So the two commands I'm going to go over are the CD command and the PWD command. CD stands for change directory and PWD stands for present working directory. So here we go. Um, we're going to start with the PWD command because it's so short. Present working directory command. That command shows exactly what it says. Um, it shows the working directory that you are in. Now we're going to learn about CD here, but if we use ls, which we learned in the last video, and do we're going to use CD to go to documents, CD change directory. Uh, goes to whichever directory you tell it to go to. So right now I'm in home a uh directory and if I want to go to just the next directory over which I, sh I printed out which ones are next by using the ls command uh, documents is the ne one of the next directories over I can change to that directory you can see it in my prompt there right there I, now I'm in, now if we do a PWD command, we are in home astrozic documents. So the, the present present working directory shows whatever directory you are in. It helps if you are, you know, not completely sure. Um, we're using bash right now, and uh, the format of my, um, my command line, you know, will show you the doc like which directory you're in right there you can see it says documents right here but not everybody's does that um you can change that to however you want you can have it show the time or the uh you know all different formats you can have it show the full directory that you're in you can have it show just the closest you know the actual uh you know relative directory so that's the pwd command and so the cd command which you just saw changed directory I used it to change into this documents directory now if we do an ls which we learned before we can go here you know say you want to go into the, the another directory so right now we're in using pwd we know we're in home astrozic documents now from there we can go into this linux pdfs documents by just doing cd followed by whatever directory you want to go into so in our case we're going to go in the linux pdfs um directory so now if we do a pwd again you know i know it's getting old but you can see it it shows which directory you're in so cd you can use it to just go you know back and forth from directories now we're in the we just went up one from documents into linux pdfs if you want to go back one you do cd followed by two periods uh, cd space two periods now if you do that we're back to documents home extras of documents um, now say you want to go back to linux pdfs you can do cd you can do what we did before linux pdf uh, you know cd and then followed by linux pdfs or you can do cd with a, a dash and that is going to take you, t cd space dash takes you to the last uh, directory that you are in compared to where you were now. So the reason that worked is because we were in documents, then we went to Linux PDFs, then we did the cd space period period and went back to documents. So the previous directory we were just in is Linux PDFs, so you can do, so that's why cd space dash goes back to there so now say we I want to go into a completely different thing here cd root or uh, we're gonna go into var well say I want to go back to Linux PDFs I can do cd dash and it's gonna take me back to Linux PDFs I can do cd dash it's gonna take me back to var so cd space dash takes you back uh, and forth between previous directories um, and what you also saw is there's there's a full there's a full path that you can go to or a 
you know, relative kind of path. So before, if we go to Linux documents, or we're in the Linux PDFs folder here, we were going back and forth, you know, using CD space dash dash, or spe uh, CD space period period, and that took me, you know, down one, or up one directory level. I can do CD, Linux, that takes me down to that. Well, CD also can take you into a completely different directory set. So, like I like you saw me do, I went to var there. Well, let's let's do cd space um, dash, and we're gonna go back to Linux PDS. I can go to cd var, and then say I you know you have these memorized if you use Linux enough. You can go to log. Uh, you know, I don't have an HTD. I don't have, but so we can completely change the whole thing there and go to the full path of our log. Um, it, you don't have to just use it to go, you know, back down one, up one, you know, you can, you can use the full path. So before we went, we knew because we used, you know, this, we used the PD, PWD command. So home, astrozic, documents, and now we're back. We're completely back. That's the long way to do it, but, um, we're completely back to where we were before. So, so far, CD, space, period, period, takes you back one. CD, uh, to a directory that is right within, which is the next directory over, took you back to Linux PDFs. Um, we went over, uh, yeah, so, you know, and then we went over the CD uh, space dash, take you down one, CD, take you, you know, back and forth between your previous, uh, directories that you were in. Now, if you just do CD by itself, it's going to take you to your home directory. So, what is known as the home, if you do PWD, since I, my user is Astrozic, the home directory for me is home Astrozic. Now, that is, that is set in there. So, if I just, if I, I could be anyway, anywhere, we went to Varlog earlier. If I do CD, again, it takes me back to home Astrozic. Um, uh, another way to get back to your home, if we do CD Varlog, you can do CD um, tilde. Now that will take you, you know, back. Sorry, back to your. Yeah, if I can type here, back to your home. Um, and. The reason you'd want to do a tilde, you wouldn't, you know, there's no point to do it if you're just going back to your home. But say we do, we go back to var log, and uh, you don't want to do, you know, we could to go back to my home, we could do cd home astrozic, right? You know, like we showed earlier, we went, I went home astrozic documents Linux PDFs. Well, look, we had to type all that out. If you, if you go here and then do a tilde and then do documents Linux PDFs, that was a lot quicker. You know, not a huge amount quicker, but you know, it had, it didn't, you didn't have to type as much. So, um, yeah, so that is how to do CD and PWD. Um, if you have any questions, just comment, and I hope this helped you out.